Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the Arkenstone Wealth video blog. My name is Ryan Howes and I work here as an independent mortgage advisor. So the first one up is mortgage loan to value and specifically with the 10% <clears throat> deposit mortgages. So pre-COVID and, and over the last few years, if you had saved up 10% deposit, it was quite easy to look at a number of lenders that would offer you a mortgage on a 10% deposit. Um, but since things have happened with COVID, although the property market has been quite resilient, um, a lot of lenders have actually pulled out of that 10% deposit space. And I think there's only one or two or three at the moment that are consistently doing it. But most lenders that come into that 10% deposit space are only there for a day or two or a few weeks. Um, and the main reason for this is, is something called negative equity. And it's basically um, your property could run the risk of being worth less than your mortgage. So if you sold your property, um, then you wouldn't be able to pay off your mortgage. And that's called negative equity. And there's just a higher risk that negative equity can happen uh, when you've got a 10% deposit. So what does this really mean? It's, it's better, and we're finding with most of our clients, if you can raise a 15% deposit, then it opens up a wider range of lenders um, and it just makes the, the whole buying process a lot easier because those lenders that are doing the 10% deposit have been inundated and their process, processing times are, are quite a bit slower. Um, we found some of our clients have, have found some creative ways to, to raise that additional um, 5% to make up the 15% deposit. Um, and it can mean just talking to family members or um, digging into extra savings that you, you may have put aside um, because, because they're wanting to, to make sure that they get that property purchase. Um, so the next thing that we're finding, one of the other issues, is a few of the, the issues that our clients are facing and that, and that we're facing. Um, if you'd like to get in touch, I'm going to leave the contact details and the links below. So please get in touch with us. And yeah, as always, thanks for watching. And I'm going to stick my head out the window now for some, for some fresh air. Cheers.